I'm so nervous. Oh my God. Hi everybody. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's been a while since I said that. Um, so I don't even know what I'm going to call this video, but basically I wanted to get on here and chat with you guys about what has been going on in my life. Um, I stopped doing YouTube. Well, I didn't, it's not like I stopped doing YouTube. I just haven't filmed or I haven't posted a video on YouTube in a couple months. So for those who watched my last YouTube video, um, I moved in the beginning of August, like the first week. So, um, I did a video saying like I moved and everything, but I'm going to try not to edit much of this video. I want it to be very raw and very, um, it's not going to be like a organized video. I was just going to just literally, I'm coming in here to talk to you guys and that's about it. So I filmed a video once I moved in, I published that. So you guys probably already saw that. Um, and that was back in August and it is... October, um, 20, it's November 20, oh my lord, have mercy, it's November 27th, it's a Tuesday, it is 1.24 in the afternoon, so I'm filming this right now, um, and I even know, I'm not gonna cry, um, it's kind of funny because I tried to film, I actually sat down and tried to film three different times before this, um, one time was in the car, and then I had another two times I was here at the house. So I have been trying to film for you guys. It just wasn't, I was in a rut. I don't even know how to explain it. I was very depressed and very not myself. I, I don't even know what to, I don't even know how to explain it. I just wasn't happy with life. I wasn't happy with myself. I wasn't happy with things that were going on in my life. I wasn't. I was in a really, really bad place, um, for a while, um, cause it's, I moved, I moved to a different state, I moved to a, a whole different house, I have no friends here, um, I left my sister back at home, I left my boyfriend back at home, um, my dad, my grandparents, even though I don't really talk to my dad that much, but like, it's so, you know what I mean, like, I don't have that comfort, uh, like I had in New York that I do here. So it was it was a lot for me. Um, I was so excited when I first moved in. Like the first couple weeks were amazing and like everything kinda like settled in and like I was I started my new job at the other Applebee's here and like it was just a lot and I didn't really have the best experience at this Applebee's. Um I actually was working there until yesterday. Yesterday was my last day. I put in my two weeks because I was just I couldn't do it anymore. Um, for reasons that I won't get into, but it was just, <sighs> I've been through so much and it's just like, and I wasn't myself and I wanted to film because like I told you, like I tried sitting down and filming for, like three different times and I just couldn't, I just couldn't. Um, and like looking back, I was so sad. I was so not myself. I was just like. I'm trying, I'm trying so hard not to cry right now. Um, I just went through such a bad, um, I'm sorry. Um, I just went through such a bad, like, I've never been so depressed and so, like, it was to the point where I almost went up to my mom and I was like, I need to see somebody because this is not going to end well. Um, if I don't get help, like, it's not, it's hard. Um. I mean, there's other things going on in my life that I won't really talk about on here. Um, but, like, it, I, w I had, like, a really bad weekend this one time, like, a month or two ago. And then, like, things were finally starting to fall in place. And I was finally feeling myself. And I was finally, like, getting back on my feet and, like, feeling good. And then, like, a couple days later, like, it just hit me again. And, like, that was the worst couple days of my whole entire life. And, like, those who know me, like... Tyler and I have broken up before. We've broken up once back in 2015. So almost, it's almost, it's like been three and a half years. It's almost, almost been four years ago we broke up. And like that was bad. Like I, whew, that was really bad. And like it was a lot on me. Like this was worse than that. Like it, this was so much worse than that breakup. Like I can't even like begin to tell you like 
how bad I have been feeling. Um, but needless to say, I am feeling great. I haven't have never felt better before. This that that bad time was like a month and a half ago. So ever since then, I've been slowly trying to get back into things and like. I've slowly been feeling myself again and being happy, which is all that matters to me. Um, but yeah, so, um, yeah, so I'm feeling good now. I'm doing great. Um, this is probably like the longest time I've been so good and been so great and feeling myself, which is amazing. Um, it still sucks though. Like I try to keep busy cause when I'm not busy, like I'll start to like think about what I don't have here that I did have like I had a couple friends back in New York and this whole move really did show me like who my true friends are and who aren't my true friends um it has been testing my limits with like family like my sister doesn't live here with me so like it's been testing me to not see her like every day and live with her obviously like I used to so that was really a big change um but yeah, it's just, trust me, I've been wanting to film for you guys, but I just literally, like, I was not, I was not in a good place as a whole, as myself. I was not in a good place. Um, I said things that I would have never said before. I felt things that I would have never felt before and would not wish this upon my worst enemy. So... Um, but yeah, I wanted to definitely get on here and just sh like talk to you guys about what's been going on. Um, so I'm in school, I'm in the nursing program. Um, the classes were filled up for the spring semester for one of my classes that I need to get fully into the program. So I have to take the semester off, which sucks. I really don't want to be a sem semester behind, but whatever. I'm not going to dwell on it, whatever. I think it's going to be a good thing for me so I can actually like get on my feet and I'm starting a new job tonight, which I'm so excited about. I'm not going to really say much about it because I don't want to jinx it and, you know, say all this nice, thing, nice things about it and, like, have it not work out. So I'm not going to tell you guys just yet. I mean, I'm sure some of you guys already know because I've talked to you about it, but I'm not going to get too much into it. Um, but, yeah, that starts tonight, my training. I'm so excited. Um, but, yeah, so I left Applebee's because it was not – a good place for me um so for those who know me I've been at the Applebee's on um in Bampton for two years at that Applebee's so I obviously transferred to this one up here because I've been there for two years like it'd be silly for me not to just you know transfer so I transferred and it was really hard like fitting in I know you're not supposed to like fit in a, I mean you're there to make money and that's the end of the story but like for me like it's hard for me to go to a place that is so not for me I'm not going to be disrespectful and down talk them or anything like that because the managers are all amazing and I've made a couple friends from work not a lot not as many as I would like to have made but I made um like one or two people that you know um and it was causing a damper on my mood I hate saying the word depressed I hate saying depression I hate because that's just like ugh, it gives me chills and I don't want to talk about it but that didn't help what was going on at home like it was actually feeling like I was it was making me worse and I don't want to do like I didn't want that so um but yeah so I ended up leaving which sucked um I didn't want to but it wasn't you know what I mean? I don't know. I need to be happy, and if I'm not happy, then I need to do something different. Like I, at, like at this point, I've never been. I never cared about my happiness or cared about me, ever. Like I'm strictly wanting to take care of myself and wanting to make me happy. I need to make me happy first. Um, but yeah, so that's that. I've never really talked much about it just because it's kind of boring, and y'all probably don't even care. But whatever. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so I am down 30 pounds. Um, some people can tell on my face. I, I mean, when I first started losing weight, I could tell on my face, but like now it's kind of like not, it's not really in my face anymore. I'm starting to lose more weight in my legs and my stomach. So I am down 30 pounds, um, which is crazy. Um, I think it's 
the weight loss, I've been going to the gym. Like I said, I'm trying to keep busy and, you know, make myself better and make myself feel happy. And going to the gym definitely helps with that. Um, I've been eating a lot less. Um, and yeah, so I'm sure like the stress and my anxiety and all that probably played a role in some of the weight loss too. But um, overall, I'm healthy. I feel great. I feel so happy. And I'm just so excited for the next couple of weeks because Christmas is right around the corner. It's so less than a month away, which is crazy. Um, I have to get through my finals and all that good stuff. And then I'll be done for until summer. I'll have to take my summer course since I can't get into the spring. So with that being said, I would like to start filming for you guys more, of course. Like I, like I just said, like I just got out of this like rut and this like mood and this persona I've been in for the past like two and a half months, three months. Like I, I, it's, it, it has not been good. Um, it has not been good. Um, but yeah, it just feels good to say that. Um, so I hope the lighting is good. I hope the echo isn't that bad. I'm in my living room right now. The TV's right here. My couch is right over here. And then, oops, and then there's another couch right here. And then my dining room is this area right here. And then my kitchen is right in there. And there's a hallway and it has all the bedrooms. There's a downstairs, a garage, all that good stuff. Um, as far as my bedroom tour, I would like to do that eventually. Um, like I said, I'm just like, we still have to hang out my pictures and stuff. Like, believe it or not, my pictures are still not on my wall. So, <laughs> but yeah, we have to get those hung up and then I can do my tour for you guys. Cause my walls are looking pretty bare. But yeah, I just wanted to hop on here and just talk to you guys because it's been so long. Like, it's it's crazy. I, like, the past three months, three, how many, it's been August, September, October, November. The past, well, the first month I was fine. I wasn't really feeling bad, but, like, then it kind of settled in, like I said. And so the past three months have been crazy for me. Like, to the point where it was too much to handle in my life. Um... It's been crazy. Um, but all you need to know is that I'm doing better. I'm feeling better. I'm happy. I'm in a good place right now. Um, but yeah. So it was definitely crazy. Um, but I guess I will end this video now. Here's a close-up of my makeup. <laughs> oh, and I got a new phone. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the quality is A1. Um, I got the new XS Max. It's the big one. It's the biggest one. And it's like, it has like the silver on the back and it's like glass and it's like the camera. This is the front facing camera and I, the back facing camera obviously is like phenomenal, but just like the front facing camera, like, please tell me this is good. Cause it is. Oh, I also got my Apple watch. That concludes this video for today. Okay. Whatever that is. <laughs> Oh, it feels so good to be in front of the camera talking to you guys right now. You guys have no idea how good it makes me feel that I'm finally doing this for you. Um, since it took four tries to finally get a video up. So I'm going to go in my room and probably have to pack my gym bag for after work. And then I will uh, probably edit this. Well, the editing that I have to do. And then I'll upload it for you guys. And I'm just so excited. I did it! Yay! Um, but yeah, so that concludes this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is probably one of the most serious videos I have filmed, um, and the most vulnerable videos I have filmed. I usually try not to get too personal with my feelings and like what's going on behind the camera. Um, but that's what's going on. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. I figured I owe you guys... Not in the, I don't want to say I'm sorry. I mean, I'm sorry that I haven't been filming. I'm I'm sorry for myself, but like, I just, I need, you guys need a video. You guys need to know what was going on and just know that I am wanting to do YouTube still. Um, I'm finally getting back into feeling myself and, uh, you know, so I gotta go. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video, which hopefully won't be too far away. Okay?